many students spend long nights in the library writing term papers and studying, you can do that at Olin College in Needham, but it also offers a more hands-on opportunity. Future engineers can get really creative, as WBC's Jacob Wyckoff found. That includes creating your own lightsaber. All right, I'm Jacob Boyd, and this is Hero Tech's lightsaber. Revenge of the Sith when it's first started showing in theaters and I remember just like oh my gosh like, this is so cool because like the fight choreography in that one is like obviously like right. incredible so ever since then I've just been hooked I'm like Star Wars lightsabers becoming a Jedi I'm like oh this is so cool. Jacob Oy is a force of nature. <laughs> the recent Olin College grad and founder of the YouTube channel Hero Tech has brought a film icon to life, a lightsaber. Your father's lightsaber. Plenty of Star Wars laser swords have been made, but never quite like this. So it is really, really bright. Um, this is like a 12 volt LED strip when we're driving it actually at like 15. Jacob founded Hero Tech as a high school student in Singapore. He had a vision to engineer gadgets from science fiction and to make them function in the real world. Join me, it is the only way. He's also created a Spider-Man web shooter and has plans for more. If you're familiar with Avatar The Last Airbender, like kind of the fire bending. And during his time at Olin, Jacob started a lightsaber project, but he knew he couldn't do it alone. What about a lightsaber? Sent out like a school-wide email. <laughs> like, does anyone want to build a lightsaber with me? That's when Madison Tong and Aaron Codrington came on board to transform Jacob's first vision into a more elegant weapon. We saw just how much work and how much passion he had for the project. You were actually one of the like main reasons why I decided to like create the stuff that I did in order to like have a portfolio to get into the school. None of this would have been possible like without them. Like in terms of like ideas and just bouncing ideas off of like every single idea I've come up with like has been through like brainstorming sessions with these guys and like they also like contributed contributed so much. And all three say the opportunities provided by Olin College have allowed them to use their creativity and work through a variety of hurdles. We basically like sat down problem by problem with like a bunch of sticky notes. It's not only like teaching you specifically how to learn in a specific way, it's teaching you how to work with other people. And because of this friendship, collaboration, and experience, the Force will be with them, always. Yep. Uh, I feel the power of the galaxy in my hand right now. <laughs> On the campus of Olin College, I'm meteorologist Jacob Wyckoff, WBZ News. <laughs> <laughs> you know J Jacob had like the best time. Seriously, that, right? like highlight of his career. But the way they're using engineering at Olin College and, the, and educating students is so real world based yeah. and, and, and such a problem solving approach. It's no wonder that people get caught up in it and really excited. And it's a great way to get younger people involved because sometimes they think, oh boy, engineering or science may be boring or difficult, but that makes it nope. fun. <laughs> Very cool. We'll be right back.